Hey guys, this is Shuman from ASA Technical. Today I am going to show you how to fix boot rec forward slash fix boot access is denied during to fix boot configuration data. First of all, this is the requested video. Several users have reported that facing issues with the command boot rec forward slash fix boot. Boot rec space forward slash fix boot access denied appears when a user attempts to fix error code 0xc0000225. This is not a common issue that occurs on a regular basis. Usually users run the boot rec forward slash fix boot command in order to write a new boot sector to the system partition. In case, if you have encountered an error during to fix boot configuration data, then this video is for you. Well, let's get started. In order to follow this process, you should have a Windows installation media. If you do not have, you can easily get that from Windows 10 media creation tool. Alright, at first let me show you what's the issue happened with me. As you can see, there are three OS installed on my PC, Windows 10, Windows 8.1 and Windows 7. When I am going to start Windows 8.1, then it's not starting and it's taking to the automatic repair loop. Alright. As you can see, Windows 8.1 startup repair cannot repair this computer automatically. Alright, next I am going to insert the Windows installation media on my computer. And I just restart my PC. Then I just click on next. And then click on repair your computer. Next click on troubleshoot option. Then choose advanced option. Next I just click on command prompt. Alright, now I just type the command bootrec space forward slash fix mbr then hit enter all right shows here that the operation was successful as you can see but when i am type the next necessary command bootrec space forward slash fix boot then hit enter then it shows access is denied as you can see however today's video is about this error issue all right let's fix it all right, just restart your computer and be ready to enter your PC's boot menu with hitting on F12 and select inserted Windows installation, CD, DVD or USB flash drive and boot from that, as you can see. Then click on next. And then click on repair your computer. Next click on troubleshoot option. Then choose advanced option. Next click on command prompt. Now type the command disk part and then hit enter. Next type the command list disk and then hit enter. Before type the next command, note, select the disk number, which disk is your boot drive, here's mine, number is 0. So I just typed here, cell disk 0, 
and then hit enter. Next type the command list whole and then hit enter. Then you will see the system reserve partition and system drive. Before type the next command note select the volume number which number is the system reserved partition. Here my system reserve partition and system drive is same. My number is 2. So I just type here cell fold 2 and then hit enter. Before type the next command, note, we suggest picking a drive letter between M and Z because earlier drive letters may still get assigned to drives that don't always show up in file explorer like optical and removable card drives. M to Z are almost never used on most Windows systems. So I just type here assign letter equals to V colon then hit enter. Now you should see the message Dixpert successfully assigned the drive letter or mount point. You are done as you can see. Alright next type the command exit then hit enter. Next type the command v colon then hit enter. Next type the command md space backward slash efi backward slash microsoft backward slash boot backward slash then hit enter next type the command cd space forward slash d space v colon backward slash efi backward slash microsoft backward slash boot backward slash then hit enter Now type the command bootrec space forward slash fix boot then hit enter. Yeah, alright. Shows here that the operation was successful as you can see. Next type the final command bcd boot space c colon backward slash windows space forward slash l space en dash us space forward slash s space v colon space backward slash f all then hit enter yeah done all right i just exit from here all right now let's check what happened now just restart your computer and be ready to enter your pc's boot menu with hitting on f12 and select inserted windows installation cd dvd or usb flash drive and boot from that as you can see then click on next. And then click on repair your computer. Next click on troubleshoot option. Then choose advanced option. Next click on command prompt. Alright, just type the command bootrec space forward slash fix mbr then press enter next type the command boot rec space forward slash fix boot then press enter all right now shows here that the operation was successful as you can see next type the command boot rec space forward slash scanos then press enter well next type the command boot rec space forward slash rebuild bcd then hit enter Alright, next type the command A for all. You are done. And type the final command exit, then hit enter. Alright, now let me show you both OS working properly or not.
yeah as you can see windows 10 windows 8.1 and windows 7 both os working properly we hope you will like of course let us know your opinion if you have any questions then please let us know please like comment and share we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you thanks for watching have a nice day